Hi, I'm Debbie Ridpath Oe, children's book author and illustrator. Ask Me to Ask is my new YouTube series in which I ask a kidlit creator to ask themselves a question and then answer it. I think that makes sense. Does that make sense? My original idea was to wait until I learned enough about animating via Premiere Pro and After Effects, but given the situation, I would rather launch a series earlier. I'm also hoping to help highlight some of my fellow children's book creators out there, especially some of those who have a lot going on at home who may not have the time or technology to be able to create new content every day. If you're one of these children's book creators, I encourage you to reach out to me via the contact form, and I've posted the link in the description under the video. Please do use a contact form rather than just tweeting me or posting a comment because, like you, I have a lot going on behind the scenes because of the situation, and so it would help keep me organized. So thank you so much for watching this video, and I hope you enjoy it. Let's get started. I just draw really loosely and I don't push the pen. I'll give you an example here. I'm going to draw a cat. So you can see that when I am drawing a cat in the way that I used to when I was a kid, for example, I'm really pushing down. I'm doing these little sketchy lines and I'm fighting it. My hand is pressed against the paper. Everything is tight and I usually scratch it out. So what I do instead is I let my hand be very loose and I draw super fast shapes and then I don't worry about getting all the details right because I know I'm going to go back and fix them later. My hand is flying all over the place when I do this and then when I'm fixing the details uh, I don't worry about how my hand feels. So that's basically it. Keep your hand nice and loose. If you're going to do this, you're going to hurt your hand. But if you're doing this all the time, it's way better. Alright, thanks very much.